Hi there, Scott with Rendell Certified Cleaning Services and I want to do a quick rug inspection on this uh, nylon that came in. Just doing a quick visual on the top side. Remember we looked at the top, the sides, the back. There's no fringe on this one so we won't check that. But I'm just kind of looking around to see if there's any any issues that jump out at me. When I talked to the client she said that there's some dog issues. So we'll take a look at that too. The front side, I mean, a little matted down in a couple of areas. It doesn't look, I mean, it looks kind of dingy and used, but it's not gross. It's not, it uh, doesn't look like there's a bunch of stuff on the front side. Let's take a look at the back real quick. All right. And this is a rug that's been bound into a, or carpet that's bound into a rug. You can see that it's got the binding along the outside edge. And we see some... Odd, odd spots and stains over here. Okay, let's take a look at it under the black light. Okay, this, this is a black light and what we're looking for is areas of fluorescence. Now some of this is latex. Latex does fluoresce a light blue and white, uh, just generally. So some of this is going to be latex. I'm not really seeing anything that's jumping out at me at the moment. There's, there's a possible one right there. See how it's different. Uh, it's fluorescing more white than our areas around it. Oh, and here's a uh, strip, but that's supposed to be there. Okay, now what we're going to do is flip it over. Take a look at the top side. And there's, there's a big fluorescent spot. I remember under the daylight we didn't see that. But we can see that because urine fluoresces under a black light at certain uh, at a certain light temperature. We're using a 365 nanometer black light, which is one of the proper light uh, colors temperatures for urine and uh, bodily fluid detection. There's another one right here. It's not as noticeable, but. There's a big yellow thing. Not sure what that is, but it's definitely fluorescing. And what we do with this data is now that we know that there's uh, there's another yellow spot. We know that there's the probability of urine contamination. We'll treat the entire rug with a urine treatment. There's another one there. One right there. It's a big one right there. Okay, well, that's uh, here's a big yellow spot here, too. That's how we uh, do an inspection using the black light on a rug, an area rug. If we suspect that there's urine or other animal or bodily fluids, we'll go ahead and fire up the black light.